Let T be a full binary tree with 8 leaves. Suppose two leaves A and B of T are chosen uniformly and independently at random. The expected value of the distance between A and B in T, i.e. the number of edges in the unique path between A and B is dash. So this is a question from data structures. Here they are giving us a tree T which is a full binary tree with 8 leaves. A full binary tree with 8 leaves will look like this. It will be this particular tree is full and it has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 leaves here. Now they are saying suppose two leaves A and B of T are chosen uniformly and independently at random. So this is what you need to give specific note to. Two leaves are chosen uniformly and independently at random. If two leaves are chosen independently at random with uniform probability, it will mean that if we are choosing this particular leaf, let us say we are numbering the leaves 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. In the first try, if I am choosing leaf 1, in the second try, I can choose leaf 1 also. Even though they say names two leaves A and B, that doesn't mean A and B are different leaves. The, nowhere it is given that. A and B could be the same leaves. So, which means in the first try, I can choose one of these eight leaves. And in the second try also, I can choose one among these eight leaves. So, there are total number of ways of choosing two leaves is 8 into 8 that is 64 ways of we can choose two leaves and the two leaves could be the same as well. Now they are asking the expected value of the distance between the two leaf nodes A and B in T is dash. So let us draw one table here in the left hand side I have given that the first node chosen is 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The nodes are numbered as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay. So, in the first try, let us say we are choosing the first node as 1. It will have a probability of 1 by 8 because each of these are chosen uniformly. Now, let us say the first node chosen is 1. Now, the second node, for choosing the second node, there are 8 options available. It can be 1 only. The second node is 1 only. In that case, the distance from 1 to 1 will be 0 because it is the same node. Now, if the second node is 2, then the distance will be from here to here and here to here. That is distance of 2. And if the second node is 3 or 4, the distance will be 1, 2, 3, 4. To 4 also, it will be 1, 2, 3, 4. If the second node is 5, 6, 7 or 8, the distance will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 4, 5, 6, 4, 5, 6. So, if I am choosing this node, the distance will be 2. If I am choosing any of these nodes, the distance will be 4. If I am choosing any of these nodes, the distance will be 6. If I am choosing one only, the distance will be 0 and all of these are equiprobable. Therefore, the expected distance to the second node will be in one case we got 0, in one case we got 2, in two cases we got 4, so we, I am writing 4 plus 4 and in four cases we got 6, that is 6 plus 6 plus 6 plus 6. Each of these are equiprobable, so we can just take this value divided by 8 to get the expected distance that will be 34 by 8 that is equal to 4.25. So if the first node chosen is 1, then the expected distance to the second node will be 4.25. Similarly, if the first node chosen is 2, the distance from 2 to 1 will be 2, written here. 2 to 2 will be 0. 2 to 3 and 4 will be 4, just like the case of 1 here. And from 2 to 5, 6, 7, 8 will be 6 only, that is 4 times 6. Again, we got the same expression as above, only 0 and 2 swapped with each other. That is again 34 by 8 or 4.25. Now, if the first node chosen is 3, again, okay, from 3 to 1, the distance is 4, 3 to 2, also the distance is 4, 3 to 3, the distance is 0, 3 to 4, the distance is 2, and from 3 to 5, 6, 7, and 8, the distance will be 6, just like we got previously. So, again, we are getting the same expression, that is 4 plus 4 plus 0 plus 2 plus 4 times 6, that is 34 by 8, again 4.25. So, as you can see, a pattern is forming here, we are getting the same value for whatever we write. So, take any random node, we will have one node, let us say, I am choosing what this node 5, we will have one node with distance 0, that is the distance from 5 to 5, we will have exactly one node having distance 2, that is that node's sibling, if it is 5, it is 5 sibling, that is 6, and there will be two nodes with distance 4, that is from 5 we have 7 and 8 at distance 4. Now these two nodes are nodes which, which are not its sibling but it belongs in the same subtree with respect to the root node. 5, 6, 7 and 8 all belong to the right subtree with respect to the root node. So the distance of 7 and 8 will be 4. Similarly we will have 4 nodes having distance 6 that is 
the nodes which belong in a different subtree with respect to that node and the root node. So this is the root node with respect to 5, 1, 2, 3, 4 belong in a separate subtree if you are taking from the root node. That is the left subtree with respect to root node. 5 was in the right subtree. So there will be 4 nodes like that which will having a value of 6. That is exactly the same for whatever nodes we choose. Meaning if the first node is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 or 8, the expected distance will be 4.25 only. Now the probability of choosing all of these nodes are the same only, that is 1 by 8. So the expected value will be this same only, since the probability of all of these is same. So the final expected value will be 4.25 only, that is the answer.